Hey YouTube, it's Sean. Hey, got a Goodwill special here. The jump starter, jump pack. Uh-huh. It's one of those. Err, uh, hang on a second. Got clampy clamp. The box. All the paperwork. And see that card? Uh, hang on. See that cord? It's never been a part or used. And that's not a good sign. Why? Because it's never been charged correctly. They used it and put it away. And now it's dead and it doesn't want to charge. It does not want to charge. So. There's the model number, and there's the brand, but I plugged it in overnight, it did nothing. Um, so what I'm going to do is I took it apart, and I unplugged it from there, and I found out that it's a 4S battery, alright, so I try to use that plug right there in my charger and it does not work it's different design so I installed a 4S that fits my charger that right that right then I insulated all between the batteries with hot glue so that they can't squeeze together and arc out that I we got that wired up Got that part done. We're going to clean up all the excess, of course. That I, the only thing left to do now is to attempt to charge it. And a lot of times you can re rescue these, these lithium batteries, these polymers, why, by slow charging them and by using an RC charger. They can balance them because I tell you that ain't much of a balancing board, especially when you charge it with a phone charger like just a regular USB, mini USB, micro USB. So let's try to save this critter. All right, hang on, let's go plug it into the charger. All right, folks, we got it. She's all hooked up and charging balance charging I don't know if you can see the screen or not it's got 1486 mm -hmm. and there's the cells which surprisingly are pretty close very very close so we'll let her run and when it's all done charging I'm gonna put it back together in the case factory it out and we're gonna go out to a car and and we're gonna give her a run we'll see if we can drain that car battery and see if this thing here will start the car that I right. that I right. so hang on there all right folks here we go keys in it dash lights are right here nothing turn in the key and there is nothing all right so let's get you set up out there and let's see if we can get this thing rolling don't know we'll dry it hang on all right folks let's see if we can hook it up
give it a minute, guys. These things have to sit on here for a minute or two. So far, it's a no-go. Now, the instructions said on this box, there is a little pinhole in the back. You're supposed to push that. And that's a solid green light now. Let's see what it does. back of this thing guys there's a little pinhole push that little pinhole right there with a whatever a tool I just used a little uh, safety pin and it started right up so apparently it's got like a weak setting and a stronger setting but it started right up after I did that. Let me show you what I mean here. Alright, right here. A little pinhole. And right now it's flashing green and red. Push that, and you hold it, and it comes on straight green, and then it started right up. Alright, so it did work. Give us a little difficulty, but it did work. Love y'all. Take care. Thumbs up.